Winnipeg. How are you? Nice, good. This is awesome. There's such a nice mix of people. There's older people, there's younger people. Younger guy at the front, hello. Hello. I'm actually not into the younger boys. I don't like them. I don't understand older women's fascinations with the young boys. I just can't imagine sleeping with somebody I might have given up. It's too creepy. Too creepy. That's the whole reason I can't be a cougar. I can't imagine being in bed with some dude and be like, who's your mommy? Who's your mommy? Who Who's your daddy? Because your eyes are familiar and it's freaking me out a little bit. I don't like the young, young ones, like 19, 20. Like, I can't imagine making out with like a 19 year old. Can you imagine making out with a 19 year old? You just start kissing down the front of his chest. You get about halfway down, you gotta stop and be like, Got your penis. <laughs> Stop crying, I'll give it back. All right, relax. <laughs> and young girls too, young girls freak me out because they don't know so much about life, right? Like they all think, oh, I got this made. I know everything, I'm 19, I know my world. Everything's fabulous. There's so many things that I was never told while I was growing up. Like my mom never sat me down like, hey, by the way, this is gonna happen to you. Like, I don't know how many younger, how old are you, sweetheart? 20, yeah, you're so young looking, yeah. Oh, there's so much that's gonna happen to you. Oh my God, there's so much that's gonna happen. Did you know, like, right about the time you turn 40, maybe like, maybe a year or two before, you're just gonna pee your pants for no reason? Oh, it's coming, trust me. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna be like, hey, I'm gonna run for the bus. This I'm pissing my pants, what's going on? And then one day, somebody's gonna come over to you and be like, oh, you got a little hair on your face. And they're gonna go to brush it off. You'll be like, ow, 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 ow. <laughs> then you're gonna get this one here, my dear. Oh, this one's coming, nice. Yeah, you're gonna grow that one in. It's gonna be hot, oh, it's so sexy. <laughs> I'm always disappointed when Movember's over, you know? <laughs> Yeah, it's so weird. So, you know, it's, I went through this really weird time. I was pretty broke for a while. And then my friends were like, oh my God, you know what you should do? You should be a dominatrix. I'm like, what? They're like, well, you're six feet tall and you have an empty basement, hello. I thought about it, I'm like, yeah, I could do that. The thing is, I am six feet tall, right? So, but the only problem is my basement's only 5'11". Yeah, you can't really dominate like this. It's hard to date when I'm this tall. I can't find any dudes that are my height or taller. It's really tough. Like, I can't find big guys. Like, I love big, giant men, and I, it's very difficult to find. And I get little guys hitting on me all the time. And, hey, I know you're here, okay? <laughs> little guys, here's the thing. You know, just stop, all right? <laughs> and tiny hands, tiny man hands creep me out tiny little man hands that are soft. <laughs> Nothing creeps me more than just this tiny little hand that comes over. Are, are you putting butter on my face? What are you doing? <laughs> no, I like big guys, but I get these little guys. Here's a hint, little guys. If you're in a bar, and you go over to a girl and she's sitting down and you're standing up, but you're talking face to face. There's a good reason she doesn't want to dance with you, okay? Just move on. I had this one guy, he was so insistent one night. He's like, come on, why don't you want to dance? I'm like, it's okay, thanks very much anyway, though. I know, it's fine. He's like, why don't you want to dance? I'm like, no, it's okay, it's fine. I don't, I don't want to dance, it's fine. He's like, come on, why not? And then finally I just stand up and I go, this is why I don't want to dance. <laughs> And he gives me one of these, oh, you're a big girl, hey? 
You're a big girl, that's what you are. You are a big girl and that's what I like. You know what I like? I like big girls and that's what you are. You are a big girl. You know what big girls don't like? Being called big girl. Yeah. We don't find it sexy. Whether you're a plus size big girl, a tall big girl, whatever kind of big girl you are, we don't like it. We don't feel sexy. We're not like, yeah, that makes me feel so good. Right, little pants? Those are the tiniest little pants ever. And here's the other line that I love that little guys always say, hey, we're all the same laying down. All the same size laying down. I'm like, yeah, you never had sex with someone's toe by mistake, have you? <laughs> oh, and here's the thing that creeps me out. So, uh, you know, you sit down next to a guy. Here's the thing. You guys, for some reason, your legs always stay, like, slim and fine and no problems or anything. And when we sit down as ladies, what happens? Squash. The leg comes out, what? I'm just looking over, I'm like, oh my God, my leg is the same size as your waist. <laughs> and then just this tiny little hand comes creeping across my leg. It's okay, little pants. <laughs> Take off your socks. <laughs> I'm Shannon Laverty. You guys have a great night. Thank you so much, Winnipeg. Okay.